Okay, so for this question, uh, we have uh, X and Y mixed together with uh, concentrated H2SO4. Uh, this one is uh, acidification. And uh, okay, so from the structure, we can uh, slightly deduce the structure. Okay, let's say uh, we try to uh, uh, hydrolyze all these ester. Okay, so when this one undergo bond break, okay, so this part will form ethanoic acid. Okay, so this one will get H and form OH. Okay, like this. And this part also undergo breaking. Okay, so this part will form the propanoid acid. Okay, one carbon, two carbon, three carbon, right? Three carbon. Okay, so here get OH, right? Okay, so it's from propanoid acid. Okay, so after that, uh, another one. Okay, this one also undergo bond breaking. So this part will form uh, the ethanoid acid. And this will form OH. This also will form OH. This is the rough idea on the hydrolysis. Uh, however, we need to depend on what the question uh, 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 needed. Okay, so it's given X is the small molecules and the Y is the larger one. Okay, so which means the X must be the compound like this, this, and this. Okay, so from here we know that after this uh, uh, all this ester bond hydrolyzed, we know that this smaller molecule or oh, it can be carboxylic acid only. So that's why A and B is out. So it must be the carboxylic acid. Okay, then answer is just C or D. Okay, and both they are ethanol acid, as you can see, huh? ethanol acid, huh? C and D. If it's ethanol acid, if you look at the hydrolysis uh, uh, of the three ester we discussed just now, only, only uh, this part and this part will form the ethanoic acid which means okay this could be the x this could be the x okay and react with the alcohol and form the uh, compound the ester z okay so means is telling us that this ester group this ester group remains no change because only this part or this part means this part or this part will react. Because these two parts, okay, is involved ethanoic acid. Okay, so from here, we therefore understand the answer most likely will be C because in C is showing the structure CH3, CH2, COO, okay, which is this one CH3, CH2, COO. Okay, this is the group. this is the part, and it's continued by CH2, CH, and OH, okay, means this part, and this part, CH2, OH, means this one, okay, this one is going to react, this one is going to react, means this alcohol is going to react, this alcohol is going to react, and this part, okay, is remain as ester. Okay, so we are quite sure the structure is look like something like this. Okay, means this one, this part, okay, this ester no change, 
the two alcohol here will react with the ethanoic acid to form the ester Z. So, answer therefore must be C. Thank you.